team 1741 Red Alert Robotics and we're here today to talk to you about graphic design and branding. Graphic design and branding are powerful tools to help you get the word out about outreach events, fundraise, recruit, and can help boost overall team spirit. Today we're going to go into some of the specific applications and how to use them and how to develop branding standards. Graphic design and branding standards is very important for your team to keep up its appearance and helps you gain momentum throughout your community and advertises for your outreach events, for recruiting, and much more. You can use your designs on social media, throughout your schools or communities, and to give to potential sponsors to inform them about your team and to try to catch the eye of people that you want to recruit. These are our team's branding standards. They help us establish a consistent font, color palette, and dimensions for our logo. This gives our team a formal appearance and keeps an overall consistency with everything. These branding standards are important when creating formal documents such as business plans, risk analysis, and statistic packets. They are also important to make sure that your website has a formal look along with the other logos and flyers that your team creates. There are several different programs that can help your team in the graphic designing process. Some of these applications include Canva, Adobe products, and iMovie. Canva is a free website that your team can use to create simple to moderate projects such as flyers, logos, invitations, and other graphic projects. This is a simple and great resource and is very easy to learn. It also gives you a gallery of different elements, backgrounds, stock photos, and more. If your team is an established nonprofit organization, you can even apply for Canva Pro for free, giving you a Canva team where you can collaborate with other members at the same time and upload fonts that align with your team's branding standard. Additionally, you can save your team's specific color palette to have access to when creating designs. You can also upload all your logos so each team member has it under one tab when creating designs. Another tool for graphic design is Adobe Illustrator. Adobe products are paid products, but if you're a nonprofit, you can usually get discounts on them. Adobe Illustrator is a very powerful tool. It is a complex program that has a steep learning curve, but it allows you to create vector art, which is important when creating t-shirts and other high quality designs, such as banners and anything else that needs to be physically printed. Adobe InDesign is a great layout and page design software for print and digital media. It is a detailed publishing software application for creating flyers, brochures, magazines, newspapers, and books. Another Adobe product is Adobe Premiere Pro. This product allows you to make complex videos with a detailed amount of options. Premiere Pro is great if you want a detailed video that is very specific, but it is also a complex program with a high learning curve. Some more beginner-friendly video editing softwares include Adobe Premiere Rush and iMovie. Adobe Premiere Rush is a simple version of Adobe Premiere Pro, and it is great for creating simple projects if you're just getting started. iMovie comes free with all Mac devices. It gives you a variety of options and is a great balance between simple and complex. It is also very easy to learn. We hope you learned some useful information about the powerful tool that is graphic design and branding. Please reach out to info at redalert1741.org if you need any help with graphic design. We would love to help.